understanding step functions, a la shmup. You think you can stand on one foot for longer than your friend Derek. Derek thinks he can go longer, so you make it uh, interesting. Derek tells you that for every two seconds you stand on one foot longer than him, he'll give you a starburst. But if you cry uncle before Derek, you have to bake him a cake. Seems a little lopsided, sort of like someone standing on one foot, but uh, who are we to meddle and who bakes cakes anymore? Good news, Derek falls down after only 47 seconds. Now you have to stand on one foot for at least two more seconds to earn anything, four seconds to earn two starbursts, and so on. Well, how can you figure out how many starbursts you'll earn if you stay on your feet, a uh, foot, for an additional 15 seconds? How about 45 seconds? Two and a half hours? Well, we can't plot a line with a slope because the number doesn't go up constantly. For instance, you stand 2.1 seconds longer than Derek, or you stand 3.9 seconds longer than Derek, you'll still get only one starburst. Derek doesn't have a sharp enough knife to cut the candies in pieces, so you can only receive a whole number amount of starbursts. Well, but we do know how to plot points, and that's all we need. So, we graph this type of situation using, uh, you guessed it, step functions, a type of piecewise function but each of the functions within it will consist of only constants making itty bitty horizontal lines like this. It's like a staircase. Oh, clever. See those open circles? Those correspond to the less than or greater than symbols in the function. Well, f of x equals 1 when x equals anything between 2 and 4. Since the function uses a less than or equal to symbol next to the 2, 2 is included in this function. Unfortunately, since the function uses the less than symbol with the 4, f of 4 doesn't equal 2 starbursts. It actually equals 3. As soon as you pass that 4 second mark, you immediately move up the chain of command and get 3 starbursts. Notice there wasn't a transition time when you got 2.5 starbursts. You just jump, or should we say step, <laughs> straight to the next whole number. All right, well, this is why step functions come in handy. The graph is still a function because every x value corresponds to only one y value. See that? Wow, going on 25 minutes, we're impressed. That's a lot of starbursts and booty strength. However, you'd better call it quits and take a bathroom break soon or else you'll be going to uh, sharing something juicy. And that's probably not what they meant when they came up with the slogan. All right. Ah. What did the buffalo say to his son as he left for school? Bye, son. Okay, bad joke, but if you survived it, how about clicking the subscribe button below? And if you're looking for more jokes from yours truly, why not check out our website at www.schmoop.com? And if you want to get updates on what's new, well, check us out on Facebook and Twitter, too. Please check our Facebook and Twitter pages, please.